working with digital tools, um, teaching emerging adults, so 12 to 14 year olds, um, climate science, specific climate science, in order to um, raise their awareness and to increase um, their understanding of it in order that we can change policy. They're going, they're going through some massive cognitive changes which actually begin at the, around the age of 11 and they end at the, around the age of 24 but they start to cement um, socio-cultural worldviews um, when they're about 14. So trying to get them before that happens and making sure that, that you know, that um, we get some, you know, some change in there, some new ways of thinking before they start to shift. If we can target this group, then we can find new avenues for tar targeting, let's say, single mothers, you know, as a specific group, and then, um, you know, making sure that the mass communication that we need is effectively targeted. We're using digital tools to deliver the, the content, so augmented reality, um, very specific game content, so it's not text-based. I'm trying to do something quite different when it comes to content delivery, moving right away from face-to-face -face lectures. I'm even moving away from e-learning, this idea of taking a normal classroom into, um, into a digital environment. We're really building these digital tools. They'll have um, pre and post um, surveys, questionnaires. So a survey about their worldviews and things like this. And then a questionnaire, very specific questionnaire about climate science. And also some very small focus groups to see if there's any kind of, some important nuances there that we're missing with those questionnaires. I think we have a lot to offer here. And I think serious gaming is, is definitely the education of the future. We've been doing, you know, these fantastic games for 20 years but we still have not put that into our education system and it's mad.